So today I figure that I'll do a um, show you off my Wii collection because ever since a few months ago I've been collecting games and growing it because I like this games. So first, of course, we got the classic Wii Sports. This is the same disc that I showed in that video that I made a while back, but I've gotten it resurfaced since then. It still looks pretty bad, but at least it plays perfectly now. Um, so that, and then next we got its sequel, Wii Sports Resort. This one's complete. Disc is like, perfect. It's just a little smudgy. So we got uh, Super Mario Galaxy. Super Mario Galaxy, reflective copy. I also have um, a matte copy somewhere. I don't know where it is, but it's a little bit beat up, but it works. It's complete in box. Um, Carnival Games. Everyone's favorite game. I bought this for like $6. Probably paid too much for it, but it's kind of fun. Next up, Mario Party 8. I don't have the manual for this one, but this disc, this disc is really beat up, but it does work, at least as much as I've tried it. Next up, New Super Mario Bros. Wii. And now this is actually a 2016 reprint from the UAE. On the disc, it actually was print. This disc, well, it looks pretty bad as well. This disc was printed on in November of 2016. That's only a few months before the Switch came out. Isn't that cool? But yeah, down here. For sale in Singapore, Malaysia, UAE, and Saudi Arabia. And it also doesn't have the reflective weep thing like most of them do. Donkey Kong Country Returns. This is a good game. I like this game. There's a big smudge on it, but not too beat up. Complete in box. Resident Evil 4. I know this isn't the original case. Complete. This looks pretty good as well. Next up, we play. This one's a pretty good one. What I mean by that is the tank game is good, not none of the other ones are. This is a little bit smudged because of me, but it's perfect. Otherwise, I found this for like five bucks at the thrift store. Next up, I got Mario Kart Wii. Of course we do. Reflective copy. Let's see, it's a little bit beat though, because I actually play this game. Complete bucks. Got Red Steel 2 with the, the price tag still on there, but yeah. Complete. This is spotless. Warrior Wear Smooth Moves. Bought this off eBay. It was like 20 bucks. And it is kind of beat up. It's got like some circular scratch on the very edge, which it doesn't seem to affect because I played through the whole game and it. I played through the whole game and it's fine. I mean, it plays. Probably, you guys are probably yelling at me saying I'm like mistreating the disc or whatever, but I don't really care. They're pretty durable. Next up, here's another $5 game from the first store Wii Music. I don't know why I bought this. This game, I don't like this game, but pretty beat up, but it, it does work, at least so far. <laughs> Clean in box. Next up we got Rayman Origins. This is a pretty, I like this game, it, I think this game because of the visuals, it's like pretty impressive for the Wii. And perfect. Complete. New play control, Mario Power Tennis. This one's kind of fun. A little beat up. I bought this for like 15 bucks. Tennis complete box. Power up your tennis game. 
Dead Space Extraction by EA. I don't really know much about this game. Come on. The, this is perfect. These are just games I've had for like years. Yep. No, of course not the original case. Um, Epic Mickey 2, The Power of 2. Comes from my cousin. Because he, he's using a USB loader now. But um, this is pretty good. Despite him being like 12 or when he owned this. Curse Mountain Steelbook. <laughs> this one's kind of cool. It comes with like it comes with like a CD. This is like okay, ignore the game. Get out of there. Okay. This this is like a DVD and a CD. See, this is the CD side and this is the DVD side. It's like some kind of documentary or not a documentary, but like a thing about it. And it has a soundtrack on the other side. That's pretty cool. Of course, that won't read in a regular way unless you have WMC in an old disk drive. But yeah, spotless. Metroid Prime Three Corruption. It's also one I've had for years. Man, just smudgy. But this is fine. Dead Rising, chop till you drop. Again, don't know much about this game. Pretty good. Again, I've had it for years. Alright, now we're getting some other ones. Super Smash Bros. Brawl with my amazing printed cover because I'm too lazy to buy a new one. Not buy a new one. I'm too lazy to buy, <laughs> buy a natural case for it. But at least I put in a Wii case. But, yeah. This is like a Nintendo Select copy. Originally, pretty good. Disney Infinity. This game loads like crap on the Wii, but it's one of the very few dual layer games along with Super Smash Bros. Do you see? Disney Infinity. Mario Strikers Charge. Nintendo Selects. Pretty good. Actually, it kind of beat up, but it works. Probably have to clean it a little bit more. But uh, yeah, I haven't played it yet. Dragon's Lair Trilogy. This one's kind of fun. It's a little bit dirty, but it's fine. This one's kind of expensive. I don't know why. Chuck E. Cheese's Party Games, aka the best game on the Wii. Got a complete unbox and everything. Just was in spotless condition, as you can tell. Took really good care of this. Yeah, this is the best game on the Wii. I should speed run it one day. Red Steel. I bought this for like three bucks, and you can see there's a GameStop figure for six bucks, so I don't think this game is ever worth very much. I don't know much about it, but this is pretty good. This is one of the early, early Wii games. Why are you super sluggers? No, this isn't the same disc I showed in that video. That's a different one. But this one's just as bad <laughs> as that one. Just a little bit better. But yeah. Complete. God. Blazing Angels. Squadrons of World War Two. This is the one I've had for years. Looks kind of cool. See, I don't actually play half my Wii games. I only play the good ones. Warrior Williams, shake it. I should play this. I need to play this. Not complete, but... Yeah. It's a little bit dirty. Smudgy. That was not from me. I think that's, how, that's how I got it. The conduit. The conduit. The pipe. Yep. Let me ask you. Lego Harry Potter years five to seven. This is also a game I played on. And you can probably tell by the disc condition that he owned it. Look at that. But that's probably also due with sitting up boxes on, on the disc itself for a while. 
Resident Evil the Umbrella Chronicles. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. Pretty good condition. I'll stay in for years and years and years. We go Indiana Jones 2, the adventure continues. There's also one for my cousin. And you can probably tell. Let's get this disc out. It's not as bad as the other, but yeah. Should play these one day. Alright, Sonic Colors. Sonic Colors. Sonic Colors. <laughs> Complete in box. This is also for my cousin. It's a little bit beat up, but works fine this is a later print because it has like a different cover on it battle beat battle lores i don't know how to say that too now i was actually pretty surprised when i found this was actually published only by nintendo i thought a different company made it but it's b we this is one i've had for years as well and it's just yeah it's definitely been i can tell it's been resurfaced it might have not been resurfaced very well but yeah. Boom Box Bash Party. This one's actually pretty fun. I like it. This is a little beat up, but it's fine. It works fine, doesn't really matter. You don't need you don't need something to be perfect. It's not like a Wii U disc. Where they have to be perfect or else they don't work. Super Mario Galaxy 2. Everyone likes this game. Basic controls. I don't know if there's supposed to be a manual or if I just didn't get a manual, but no, it's fine. Where is this? No, I think it's... Yeah, it's supposed to be like that. Anyways, this... Definitely tells some resurfacing marks, but... Yeah. Works. And lastly, for this case, like case games, we got Go Vacations. Complete. Get out. I think it tells some resurfacing marks, but... Whatever, it works. Alright, so now... Um, crap, where'd it go? Oh, okay, it's in the game. We got my case of games. These are just, like, disc-only games I got. So, in here, got another copy of Mario Kart Wii. Works. Another copy of Super Mario Stories, and this is the one I did use in that video. This is my childhood copy, and it's really scratched. It still works, though. Mario Party 9. Pretty good. Super Paper Mario. This is a pretty fun game. I like it a lot. I need to, I'm, I'm close to beating it. Yeah, not, okay, not really, but... Um, yeah. Get my fingerprints on it. Another copy of New Super Mario Weed. This one kind of has issues. This is my cousin's. Can you tell? But this is not a UAE copy. This actually came in a Wii, red Wii bundle. Here's another copy of Red Steel 2, except this one is very, very scratched. I'm surprised it even still, like, reads, at least to the title screen. Punch Out is also... This is also a fun game, I like. This game... I know I said that a lot, but I just don't, like... I don't know how to talk, but yeah. D blob, this one's also kind of fun, except the, this this hair. Can you kind of see it has like a really big scratch right there? It's like a dent, and um, I don't know. I haven't I haven't played far enough in it to actually have any problems, but it definitely will have a problem once I actually reach that point. Got a we play we play motion. I don't like how the Wii logo is off center. It makes me feel uncomfortable. Pretty good. Wait, why did I just say pretty good? It looks terrible. Pretty good. And lastly, we got the Smurfs Dance Party. It's also one I've had since my childhood. And, yeah, pretty grungy. So that's it. That's all my games that I have right now. I have, oh, I have, um... I have new play control Pikmin disc only somewhere, but I don't know where it is. But yeah, that's all my games. Bye.